It's good to talk yourself up because it puts you at a higher standard of potential. If you're like, I was in a club, they see me in a pub anyway. She saw me like a beacon, brighter than a light, and she was tweaking, running through the streets. The streets want me. Hey, what's up? It's your boy. J Wiggs reacts here today and we're back with another video Today we're gonna be reacting to Andrew Tat. I do not know who he is I've seen him a couple of times around social media, you know glimpses of him on thumbnails and things like that. So Today I'm gonna educate myself on who he is and what he does and uh a Little bit of controversy about him, but I literally don't know what he what he's really about um, but let's uh, hop right in. This will be a quick intro, you know, nothing crazy. I'm actually really intrigued. I want to find out what this guy really be on. Let's go. Let me ask you a question. Do you have a girlfriend? Yes. Are you loyal to your girlfriend? Yes. Do you want to be? Yes. Why? So, he just I, and, I, and I see. No, it's all the no. no, I understand it. I understand. Carry on. I'm listening. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm listening. I, I, and I feel like the best way. <laughs> What's I up? decided. I didn't even decide. Oh, um, sorry. I have to start that over. Did he just say like you're a simp for like? Let me ask you a question. Do you have a girlfriend? Yes. Are you loyal to your girlfriend? Yes. Do you want to be? Yes. Why? He so, just I, said. And I, and I see. No, it's all a simp. No. no, I understand it. I understand. Whoa, whoa. Ugh, I'm cringing. You have a girlfriend? Yes. Um, why? Okay, I'm not gonna really repeat all that again. Y'all, y'all already saw. I'm not gonna act like y'all didn't just see what I just saw. But it's like, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's making me cringe. It's like, oh my gosh. I just, wow. Damn, bro. I just feel weird about that. I'm no, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm I, I, and I feel like the best way. <laughs> I decided. I didn't even decide. I realized yesterday. That I can actually, genuinely, right now, nothing is stopping me from becoming that. Nothing. I have a Batcave. Okay. Yep. I have an Alfred. Okay. I have a Batmobile, a Bugatti. Yep. I can fight. Bugatti? Yep. You can afford body armor and all the crap that All Batman the crap. Needs. can buy yep. it all. I'm charismatic. There is nothing stopping me putting on a suit and being Batman. Andrew, I know you said money isn't real. Bugatti? Nah, um... Okay, that one wasn't too bad. This guy's just very um, confident in himself. He has a very big ego. That wasn't too bad. I, I, I didn't actually, I wasn't against that one. You know, right now, I'm actually Spider-Man. But, you know, the one I would just ask Doctor Strange to erase your, your memory and you won't remember that I just told you on Spider-Man. All right, let's keep going. But I am getting fucked. Let's start that one over. Hold there on, is hold nothing hold on. stopping me no. putting on a suit. That one like is being weird. Being Batman. Andrew, I know you said money isn't real, but I am getting fucked. And I go out. <laughs> Bro, I mean, was that staged? Like, was that like? Oh my gosh, that was weird. That one was weird. Like that was a that one was a little toxic. Like you had someone that's rich saying money isn't real, and then this guy's kind of toxic. And I go out and fuck, and I come back to her, and I don't care about her, and I only love my. Why does happen so real. fast? Like, am I like do I need to like awaken? Let me try to read it, all. <sighs> and I go out and fuck, and I come back to her, and I don't care about her, and I only love my girl. That's not cheating. That's exercise. I know how to administer CPR. Yo. However, I will not administer CPR. When I go out to go soy, um, and then come back to my girl, that's not cheating. That's exercise. I love my girl. But that's not cheating. That's just exercise. Again, this guy's kind of hurting my head a little bit. I don't if like this are, energy. Unless you're a hot female. You want to kiss your missus on the lips. This is 
I'm sorry. It's not cheating. It's exercise. I don't know how to administer CPR. However, I will not administer CPR unless you're a hot female. You only kiss your missus on the lips. This is the reality. If you're some fat dude and you just had a heart attack and I don't really know you, you're gonna die. I mean, if you're a really good friend, no, not even if you're a friend. You better, if you're my friend, you just can't be a pussy. Well, I had a heart attack. Get the fuck up. What's wrong with you? Go hospital later. Have a drink. Cigarette. Cup of coffee. Oh, this Back guy is. Fucking having heart attacks near me, you little pussy. Yo, what's I'm wrong with this dude? Blood. Lacking in prog. Lacking. What are you doing? I was getting on a plane and I could see through the cockpit that a female was a pilot and I took a picture and I said, most women I know can't even park a car. Why is a woman flying my plane? And they banned me. Oh my god. Come a 55 kilo female. I will pick you up with one hand by your titty. Yo. I will never ever wear headphones in public. When you put your headphones in and you're walking down the street listening to your music, to the, you are a fucking target. You are losing one of your most important sensory senses. I'll tell you yeah, something. but I relax. Times. Every time I was jumped, I didn't see it coming, but I heard it coming. You got jumped? Bro, Bro, relax. I get you, though. Miami. I completely and utterly disagree. Especially if you have the OnlyFans. Make a bag off it. Fuck it. I made a million off of it. <laughs> Only a million. Is that it? We got you. 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 Hey, Ross. Are you hitting six gallons a month? Supercars. Outside a club, right? Let's say the Lambo's outside. And dudes are trying to break in. Even though I know the locks, the alarm, the immobilizer are solid, am I going to allow them to try? No. no. So if I have a chick, even though I know she won't let them smash, even though I know she knows what they're about, and even though I know she's loyal to me, out of respect for me, it's not jealousy. It's territorialism. If you want me to truly love you, you are my girl. Mm -hmm. And no one's going to be allowed to even try, even though I know you won't let them. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Because how am I supposed to have a chick I truly love and care about when every dude in the world can just hit on her, even if she says no, just hitting on her nonstop. If you want to go to the club, you can go with me. If you want to go to Maldives, baby? I'll take you. I'm not going to lie. I kind of like that. Like, so far with everything, he's a little, like, egoistic and, you know, um, full of himself and all these things. But... But this one was interest an interesting take. I never heard that before. Um, if you have a car, you know, and you and you and you know that the car is very secured and everything like that, you know they can't get in the car, but they're trying to steal your car. You know, he's saying that he wouldn't let them um attempt to steal the car. And he refers it back to his girl. Now he seems to be seeing as he seems to see females as like a sort of item or something of ownership that belongs to him now um in some ways a woman is like belongs to the man and the man belongs to the woman it goes both ways in certain concepts um but we're gonna go back to like the whole car thing so then he says that his woman is gonna get hit on and stuff like that but he is going to try to stop them from attempting to hit on his girl um and that's an interesting take like even if she says no every time and all that he said that he's he doesn't like that they're attempting because it's like it's also disrespectful in some way to some guys it's like you know okay you know you're insecure why do you care about another man complimenting your your girl woman and it's like in some ways, that is kind of strange. If the if the man like literally inf is, sees you and a woman there, and then he compliments the woman, say, "Oh wow, you're beautiful," and then walks away, and she says, "Thanks." And the guy is there. That's disrespectful because one, he didn't introduce himself to the guy. <laughs> like if he he could say, "Hey." Sir, you have a very beautiful um girlfriend. You know, I hope you both enjoy the rest of your day. Or like um sir. Oh wow, and miss. Um you look very beautiful. You both look like a very beautiful couple. Like or you can compliment her first. Hey, miss, you're so beautiful. You're both a beautiful couple. Like 
you have to like in respect you have to like put them together at the end of it or in the beginning because if you only like register the female or if the female only like if it was the opposite of a, if it was a female not accompanying a guy the girl's gonna be tight because like like she the the, the female just pretend like the girl doesn't exist that's weird so in some ways he has something this dude andrew tat has something he's work working with right there i like i like that a little bit like you know it's interesting like you know he would stop that from like like all that extra like yeah but then you gotta be careful too because then that's how you get into fights and unnecessary fights and confrontations and it's just it's just a lot you just gotta be careful out here y'all stay focused kings Imagine one day you're sitting in Paris, you're sitting there having a fucking coffee, and terrorists roll through with AKs, and the person next to you has their brains blown out. You're gonna stand there and be like, waiting to die like a motherfucker. I'm gonna be like, bang, oh, I've seen that before. Okay, boom, boom, duck and dive in, take one terrorist out, next, get the AK, go Rambo. I don't play games. Okay. I, have nerves as children. I mean, for that one. It's easy to say how you would do something when you have the time to think. Um, but I'd say it's good for everyone to like program their mind uh, before time. That if something like that were to happen, you need to act fast. Because if you literally just let the shock like paralyze you, you can be gone next. Now, for him to be talking about attacking the, the the terrorists, taking the gun and going Rambo, okay, that's that's a bit much. But at the same time, it's good to think like that and talk like that because what can happen is that can literally amp up your adrenaline, like literally, like your adrenaline, like oh, this ninja just said he's gonna t attack the terrorists, take the terrorists' gun, and then shoot the other terrorists when that adrenaline hits bro it can be manifested like that like that you feel me and like yo i ain't gonna lie i was talking to someone about this the other day like yo it's good to like have high expectations well in terms of like it's good to talk yourself up because it puts you at a higher standard of potential if you're like, oh, I'm going to do my best, but, you know, if whatever happens, happen. Like, now you got to be like, yo, I'm about to get it. I'm about to, to do, yo, when I do this, it's about to be finesse. It's about to look amazing. It's about to be lit, bro. On everything, it's about to, yo, it's about to be great. You feel me? And then when you go, you go with that expectation. You finna try to, you finna try to match that energy. If you go, you're like. Yo, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just do my thing, you know. I'm gonna try my best and see how it goes. And then you're gonna go there at like probably half of your potential. Like, yo, come on now. So he's a little, you know, he's a little sec. Let me leave him alone for now, cause uh, this is my first time seeing him, and we need more. Have a nerd carry the leg tape. If my son is a nerd, one of us has to die, him or me, and I'll challenge him to mortal combat. What the he hell? Knows. Waiting to die like a motherfucker. Bro, what are like, you on? I've seen that before. Okay, boom, boom, duck and dive in. Take one terrorist out. Next, get the AK, go Rambo. I don't play games. I will not have nerds as children. I refuse to have a nerd carry the lame tape. If my son is a nerd, one of us has to die, him or me, and I'll challenge him to mortal combat. There's another thing that a lot of people Yo. make a mistake with when I talk to them. Like, ah, oh, I have to go to work today. Change your language. I get to go to work today. Imagine you had no job. Be worse, right? So you get to go to work. Oh, I have to fix the car. At least you have a car. Most people don't got one. Oh, I have to go get the kids. You get to go get the kids because you have these beautiful children who love you. People's even their own language is wrong. Maybe I'm completely crazy. Maybe I'm full of shit. But the frames I've installed in Bro, my mind are all beneficial weird. to me. But if that makes me crazy and full of shit, good. <laughs> because I can't become depressed. It's weird how this ninja could just be saying some BS. And he'd be saying some good ass.
I'm in hospital right now from a bike crash. I broke my back. I currently can't walk. I may not walk again. What would you guys do in my situation? I appreciate you guys a lot. Thanks. That's terrible news. Find uh, James, the guy whose name you can't see. Find his YouTube. Let's contact him privately. And I want to verify that story. And if it's true, we're, we're here to save you, brother. We love you. Yeah, we're going to help you out. That's a true story. Um, what, what you can't do is sit around thinking, oh, I wish I hadn't ridden my bike. Oh, I wish I hadn't crashed my bike. I wish you can't do that because you'll destroy yourself, brother. So if this is a true story, we're going to get in touch and we're going to help you out. So there you have it, Andrew Tat, a very uh, interesting fellow, I will say, very interesting fellow. Um, I hope you all enjoyed. You know, this was interesting. I do want to like react to more things like this, you know. But I'm going to react to every, anything anyway, but I would like to add things like this to my arsenal. Uh, this was a little interesting, you know. I feel like it's been a while since I reacted to something like this. Like, this was, like, actually interesting. I, I was good to, I get to, like, talk about topics that actually have been stored in my mind for a minute, so. Yo, sh yo should I get waves? Like, like I'm going to put my head up like this. Like, look. Wait, should I get waves? Like, y'all messing with this? Like, if I didn't have the braids and stuff, like... Oh, damn, I look like... I look, I look weird. But, yo. I hope you enjoyed my video. Um, Andrew Tat, top 10 or 15, um, viral TikToks that he's done or is about him. I don't even think that Ninja do TikToks, so there are probably people that's clipping his stuff. But I hope y'all enjoy. Like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for more. j Reacts. I'll be out of here. Later. I was in a club. They see me in a pub anyway. She saw me like a beacon. Brighter than a light.